walking in silence. Should we it's role nice. play? Oh my god, let's role play. What should we be? It's like you are the master and I am the apprentice. Okay. Hang on, I'm turning off my camera. I'm immersing the audience. So it's like I'm your dad and you're my son. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Are we there yet for that? <laughs> I don't like this. I hate this. <laughs> son, this is this is gonna go. We gotta go deep. Morty, Morty, we gotta go deeper. Follow me. I'm following. Follow me. I'm following. <laughs> Follow me. I'm following. Let's go. I'm following. We're going down. We are. Goodbye. I'm following. Goodbye. I'm with you. Yeah. I'm you. It keeps on going. I know. I'm about to pass you. Stop. I'm about to lap you. No, 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 no. What Wait, the fuck not, is this? Go here. What let's the fuck is here. this? What the fuck is this? <laughs> so let's keep on going. Come on. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Welcome to my home. This fucking sucks. Where do I get to sleep for that? <laughs> Do I get oh. to sleep in there? <laughs> I just got another gift for you. There you go. Right. I know Helen and Ben are trying to have matching skins, mm -hmm. but they kind of just look like siblings. Hold on. Did you brush your teeth? <laughs> oh no, I didn't do that yet. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Delicious. I swallow the, the thing so I can get a little buzz before I go to bed. <laughs> the little Good night, hard boxers. Good night, son. Wait, let me turn off the lights. <laughs> Good night, father. Good night, son. I had a nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> I went to bed, father. <sighs> Honestly, I feel like we could just get up. I gotta punch out this wall, dad. Give me two seconds. <laughs> You got your violent tendencies from your mother. <laughs> you don't even know my mom. <laughs> I'm a I guess I know man. your mom. No, you don't. What's my mom's name then? Huh? Uh, Chrysanthony. Chrysanthony. <laughs> like the flower and the name. <laughs> Her name was Chrysanthony Gomez. Oh, so what's my name, father? Well, it's a combination of my name and your mother's name, Sport. Wait, what's my name? So my name is Josh. Okay. So your name is Chris Anthony Josh Gomez. <laughs> you see, Chris Anthony, I'm a feminist, so you have your mother's last name. What's your last name, Josh? It's Gomez. I took her name because I'm a oh, feminist. Oh, you took because you're a feminist. <laughs> I'm a okay. Fe Who was my mom? Can you tell me more about her? She had tits the size of basketball, let me tell you. NBA basketballs or WNBA <laughs> basketball? Well, you know, one was that and the other was that because um, boobs, breasts, as I know because I'm a feminist, are cousins, not sisters. <laughs> I so, love you, son. I hate you. I mean, I love you, dad. <laughs> so wait, you're my dad, biologically. Mm -hmm. So yes. Chris Anthony, what, what, she's, is she dead? Um... Yeah. What happened she, to mom? She fell really far. From where? A height. How high was the height? It was really high. Where did she fall from? Okay, but you gotta follow me here. I'm following. She fell off the top of the Eiffel Tower, right? Really? Like the tippity top? Yeah, it was during our, our honeymoon affair. Uh, our, your honeymoon affair? <laughs> Your honey, our honeymoon. Um, you were four at the time. It was, it was a that was a, that was a premarital birth. You're a bastard, son. Why did you? Well, you know what? We'll touch on that in a second. I just need to know how my mom fell off the Eiffel Tower. So we were honeymooning, and believe it or not, there was a gang of burglars that was running by. Oh shit! They had the crown jewels. They had the crown jewels. They, they had the have crown the fleur de lis for... insignia. They had the fleur de lis, the fleur de lis, the fleur and they de also had the crown of thorns, which is also in France. And um, Jesus, and Jesus's crown of thorns, and oh my they gosh. stole it. And so what happened? And when I was reading the news, what happened was they were in they were in a zeppelin, and uh -huh. the zeppelin exploded. Wait, what? <laughs> wait. <laughs> no, no, no. You know what? Continue. We'll do a recap in like two seconds, because I surely I missed something. But go on, Dad. It's in here, son. The Zeppelin exploded. Listening, this, was, listening. This, was, this was this was this was this was 1937. Mm -hmm. These were real crafty criminals, right? Yeah, yeah. 
real, 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 uh, real, uh, brilliant, uh, brilliant burglars. They kept parachutes on them because little did we know at the time that the explosion was planned. Oh, they planned the explosion? They planned the explosion and they were gonna land on top of the Eiffel Tower and they were gonna make their big escape because it was actually the World's Fair that day. Okay. We decided to, to honeymoon during the World's Fair because your mother, she loved inventions. She loved tinkering about little tools, little baubles, little bits. She was a tinkerer. She was a tinkerer. Unlike me, I, got, I, I don't have a single artistic bone in my body. Do you think that I am a tinkerer father? Um, well, we'll find out when we get a little bit older, son, right? You have a, your whole life ahead of you. You're only two. Um. Wait, I'm two. <laughs> so, the burgles were come down. Your mom, the tinkerer, she was like, hold on a minute, these look like burglars. They were in the black and white stripes. They had what little goggles. What does being a tinkerer have to do with her identifying criminals? So listen on. here, son. I'm sorry. You're, you're real cheeky for cutting me off this No, much. no, I, I don't mean it. You know, like, it's just, you know, I just have questions, but uh, we can- She's got tools, she's tinkering. That. Um, <laughs> the burglars fall from the sky. Burger. <laughs> They land on the Eiffel Tower, they do a little flip, they do a little kick. It was spectacular, son. Your mom, she was real nosy. She had to stick her nose in other people's business all the time. So she's a tinkerer and she was like, these are clearly burglars that I have identified, in which I will now proceed to stop them. She had a grappling hook and she was gonna snatch the bag that they had uh -huh. over their shoulder. She's gonna snatch it away and bring it to the authorities, right? Yeah. And now listen, son. Your your mom never made a tool that did not work. Uh huh. This tool worked perfect. A little too perfect, in fact. Cause you know what? When you when you when you wish for something, you wish too big. Sometimes it comes back to bite you in the butt. Her tool whipped out, snatched onto the bag that the burglar was holding. The burglar wouldn't let go, and this tool was strong enough that it reeled both of them back in. So both the bag and the burglar were coming flying at her. Uh huh. And it hit her. And hit her with such a force that she let go of her tool, she toppled backwards, fell to the bottom of the Eiffel Tower. She hit splat on the pavement, Dad. She hit splat on the pavement, Dad. <laughs> dad. It was really... <laughs> Sorry, I... I'm choking up because it was a really traumatic moment for your son, you have to understand. Did you watch her fall, Dad? Yes, and I couldn't do anything about it. You just watched her fall down? Yeah. Do you miss her, Dad? Well, you know, son? Mm. It's not a matter of missing and not missing. Yeah. It's about 100% of the shots that you miss when you don't take. <laughs> Can I? So wait, when you, I'm sorry, you meant the Hindenburg disaster? <laughs> this was just a Zeppelin disaster. <laughs> but the, the Zeppelin exploded. Yes. Which is very similar to another Zeppelin that exploded. <laughs> Which was the Hindenburg disaster. Can I say something, by the way? For sure. What year did I say this take place? 1936 or something? Bro, I don't know, but I could. if it was the Hindenburg disaster, that would be accurate. The thing is, I didn't even realize how accurate I was. I was saying the Hindenburgs, I didn't think I got the year right, but the year was 1937. <laughs> so, I kinda... no, wait. Your, my mom witnessed the Hindenburg disaster. It and wasn't then the tried... Hindenburg, though. It wasn't the Hindenburg, a, though. A Hindenburg-esque disaster. <laughs> <laughs> Tried to stop the criminals that did it and fell off the top of the Eiffel Tower <laughs> trying to stop them because she was she a tinkerer wasn't stop and couldn't <laughs> yes. help herself. She wasn't trying to stop them because they made the airship explode. We found that out later in the news. I did, because your mom was dead. Um, she was trying to stop them because they were clearly burgling something. The explosion wasn't even relevant at that point. I mean, like, what's she gonna do? Stop the explosion? It already happened. <laughs> My mom was so brave. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she what didn't even like woman. France like that. She was just had a high moral code. Ever since then, I ever since I heard that story from my father, I hated the French. I couldn't <laughs> stand to look at them in their stupid tower. And I, I swore to get re revenge <laughs> on whoever built that godforsaken building. I hated the French and I hated uh, burglars. <laughs> the French <laughs> and I hated committing crimes. Can you imagine? That story track. I was, I was trying to do it on the fly, and doing things on the fly is hard. Did that Wait, track? 